clipboard data sources. Now, the thing that's cool about this um, is you can actually just ad hoc grab some data and paste it straight into Tableau. Now, let me give you an example of when you might want to do that, and then we'll actually do it in Tableau too. So let's say this test one sample data source that I've connected to is actually some enterprise uh, database. And so I don't have the ability to go and modify it or change it like I would if I just had an Excel document. And I've got my salespeople here, but what I want to do is add more context to who those salespeople, uh, what we're actually, let's say it this way, where those salespeople are actually making their efforts. And so one of the things that's really useful about this idea of a clipboard data source is when you use it for a blend. We want to match the level of detail of the salesperson, but we want to add more information. So let's hop over to my little workbook that I prepared here. This is some information I've typed up. These are the salespeople that are in that other data source. And these are, these, these are their sales regions or countries that they look after. So I could go and connect this uh, as a data connection in Tableau. But instead, what I'm going to do is just select all this data and copy it. And then we'll hop back to Tableau. And then Control-V, I'll paste it in. Now, it'll take just a second as Tableau sort of figures out what it wants to do with that. But when it's finished, you'll see a little clipboard data source pop up here, which is me literally pasting that data ad hoc into Tableau. Of course, I can right click and rename that. We'll call that sales regions just for reference. And let's go back to the sheet that I just created. So I've got salesperson. And in my sales regions, I also have a salesperson. Of course, because Tableau is so smart with the blends, it's already got the data connection ready to go. The, I should say the data relationship that you would need between two blended data sources. So what I'll do now is I'll just take my region and I'll add it to this view. Pretty straightforward, pretty easy. I will give you some caution here. If you are trying to copy and paste in a lot of data, whether it's a really long table or really wide with a lot of columns, you, you saw how long it took Tableau to sort of think through me putting in basically 10 records with two columns. Um, use this with some caution. If you've got a big data source, just go ahead and use sort of your standard data connections to get that plugged in. But if you want to do some ad hoc analysis, uh, by all means, give it a go. And one of the reasons I like to use clipboard data sources, I'll have an idea for a dashboard I want to do. And I want to kind of see how viable it is as a dashboard first before I go and prepare all these data sources and do all the sort of the piping of the data first. Um, I'll mock up what I want my data to look like at the end state, paste it in here, and then kind of create a, a vision of it. Um, so pretty useful, pretty fun. Another really cool little tool that I think most people probably don't even realize that they can do.